Crystal Lay, thank you so much for doing this. I know you're super busy. Earlier this month, you won the bikini overall at the NPC Southern USA. Winning an overall is so difficult. How did you have such an amazing prep for the show? You know, it really started in my off season. I took a long off season, year and a half actually from my last show. And I think that was really key for me to find balance with life and food and my training. So um, that was really good for me. During the overall comparisons, what was that moment like when your name was announced? Oh my gosh. Well, first I was in shock. Well, I mean, kind of. I, I did work my butt off for this, so I felt like I earned it. Um, but yeah, so I was in shock. I was excited. But I mean, all you do when you're on stage, just get up there and do your thing. You've been practicing. I, mean, I know I practice every day in my posing. So that's all I had to do. You're doing another show soon. How is your body feeling right now? Um, well, it took a couple weeks to kind of eat what I wanted. <laughs> that was really good. Good for my mental, my, my whole, um, my mind. <laughs> so now um, I'm feeling, I'm feeling ready. I'm feeling, I'm feeling seven and a half weeks out. <laughs> and which show is this? The Junior USA in South Carolina. Did you do fasted cardio this morning? Of course, every day. <laughs> what about goals for this year? Have you written down any goals? Oh, I have a little bit of goals here and there. Um, as far as shows go, I just want to see how I do at this show and go from there. Um, personal goals, of course, business-wise and, um, you know, just personally, we all have our own little goals that we want to achieve. Did you win in the overall in a show earlier this month kind of shift what you were doing for with competing? Yes. I originally had a few other local shows planned, um, but once I won this, this past show, um, it, it nationally qualified me, and the promoter of the Junior USA was there, and he said, yep, you need to go to Junior USA. So changed my plans, and that's where I'm going. Your determination, your motivation, where, where does it come from? Um, it comes from inside me. Um, what I want to do for myself, my own personal goals. What's it like competing in shows together with your soon-to-be husband? <laughs> well, that was our first one we've ever done together. Oh, was it? Okay. Yeah. Before, um, you know, in the past, it's always been I've competed in the spring and then he would do a fall show or vice versa or something like that. So um, it was really nice to be able to have him go through the process of prep with me. We posed every morning, doing fasted cardio together. It was really good. It was, it was um, extra motivating, kept us on track. We didn't have any bad food in the house, so that was really good. <laughs> Usually if I'm in prep, he's eating like donuts and cookies and candy, and oh my gosh, it drives me nuts. <laughs> Are you guys getting married later this year? Well, we actually already legally got married. Um, I want to change my name to start competing in the NPC. and um, But we're going to have our wedding, our ceremony this fall. Well, that's cool. Do, do you see yourself in the future you know, stepping on the Olympia stage year, years from now? Oh, my gosh. That would be a dream come true. So I have that in my sight. That's like my moon that I'm shooting for. <laughs> yeah. One step at a time, though. Local shows, national qualifier, that was step one. Now let's go to nationals and see how I do and go from there. Mm -hmm. Have you been to the Olympia in, in Vegas? Have you gone to the Expo and stuff? I haven't, and I would love to. That and the Arnold, those are my goals to go to. Well, what do you think it's going to take for you to get there to the Olympia stage? Um, I think I need to build a little bit more. Um, I, I have a really hard time. My body frame just doesn't want to put muscle on, so I train really hard and, and eat as best I can to try to get that to, um, to build. So I'm working on my glutes, fuller rounder. Um, I have pretty nice shoulders, so I want to keep those, keep my little tiny waist and just working on overall development, muscle maturity. Someone might be, wa might be watching this video. They're maybe struggling to eat healthy, work out, wish they could be like you. What would you say to them? One day at a time, one meal at a time. Everyone's human. Um, I'm a big fat kid inside. I want to eat all day long. I have the appetite of a bodybuilder, <laughs> but the body of a bikini girl. So um, it's okay if you slip up, no big deal. Just get right back to it, your next meal. 
And train hard. Use those extra calories in the gym. Yeah. Well, what about, um, so you're on prep right now from morning to night. What's a typical day looking like for you right now? Wake up, fast the cardio, come back, eat my first meal. Depends on um, the day, what it is. High carbs, lower carbs, kind of see um, how my body is responding. Um, and then I email clients. Um, I do posing sessions through Skype or FaceTime. Um, I do diets and training programs for people. So that's what ma the majority of my day. Um, I'll have a couple more meals, at least another meal, and then I train in the afternoon, come home, eat again, <laughs> keep working. Um, uh, I'm doing about five meals right now and working. I work from home most of the time. So working between the meals, training, that's my day. When someone is competing, the posing is so important. How often are you practicing that? Every day. There's a couple days where I'm just like, eh, I don't want to right now, and that's okay. But most of the time, every day. Is there? Do you have your own coach guiding you? My husband. Um, he has always helped me through my preps. That's cool. What about people in this fitness world? Um, anyone who inspires you? Oh, yes. Um, of course, my favorite bikini girls are Janet Leigh. Um, she, she was my first one, like my ultimate physique. Um, there's a few others, of course, that I love. Um, Angelica Texera is amazing. I love her personality. Um, you know, yeah, there's all those girls, all those, the Olympias, the big ones. Did you watch Angelica win the Arnold and, um, in USA and Australia? On I did. I did. I thought it was very well earned. That's cool. Tell us about, last question for you, your family, you have a daughter, um, you guys are living in Florida. What's the Florida life like? You guys seem to always be at the beach. Yeah, that's our favorite thing. That's why we're here in Florida and not in Maine anymore. <laughs> um, my daughter, she's seven. She loves the beach. She loves swimming. She's a little fish. So in the summertime, we literally are living in the pool. Well, congratulations on your overall win. That's just incredible. Good luck with Thank the next you. show. And Thank you. Just have a good rest of your day. Enjoy the prep. We'll talk to you later. Thank you.